I, I think the, the best practices approach um, is fairly simple if it's incorporated in a routine, both the patient asking for it and the physician knowing to ask for it. Uh, one of the things that you need to identify as a patient is who's going to be your primary physician caregiver. Who's the doctor who should be called if you're in the emergency room or if you need a dental procedure or a routine surgery or if another doctor prescribes you a medication who's experienced in myotonic dystrophy and can answer those questions for your other providers. You may have six or seven different doctors all of whom are expert at their specific field, but may not be an expert in myotonic dystrophy. And if you aren't fortunate enough to live at a center where uh, uh, active myotonic dystrophy research is going on, you can still assemble a skilled team to take care of you if you communicate. I think of it as uh, the, the metaphor of uh, blind men examining an elephant, that each specialist is very expert at looking at their particular field, but you need somebody who can put the whole elephant together.